How's it going, guys? Lucas from Pow Pop, and today we have another Bakugan Battle Planet opening. Is what I would say if we were opening a Bakugan product, but we are not. Today, we are opening finally on my channel, because you've noticed everywhere, here, here, there's also a thing up there that you rarely get to see, but sometimes it's in frame. We are opening a Yu-Gi-Oh! product, and today is Battles of Legend Heroes Revenge. The new Battles of Legend set is finally out, and I... Now that I have a decent amount of income, I can finally buy booster boxes again! I mean, mind you, I haven't really been wanting to buy booster boxes of the latest sets in a while, just because, I don't know, I'm picky. But, this is going to be interesting for me. Especially because, the main reason I bought this was because I need a Boral Sword Dragon, and this is re that's reprinted in the set. But, uh, about that, my good friend, Tim, already pulled one. And he already had one. So now I have one. So. Everything in these two boxes are going to be bonus. So, I'm not opening both of these boxes this video. I'm going to open one box this video, and then there'll be another video with the second box. Just to make things very clear. I just wanted to show both of them to show you what you're in store for. So, let's just not beat around the bush. Let's start with our first box of Battles of Legend Heroes Revenge. It has been a hot minute since I've opened a Yu-Gi-Oh! product, though. The last thing I opened was, like, I think the structure deck. The Endymion one. Well, hold on. Eh. Off frame, had to tear it. Let's open this box. It has been, seriously, it has been a long time coming. Finally, some Yu Gi Oh! on this channel. Hopefully, want to try and get some more now as more sets come out. So, there's the little display. We're going to move that. And here's the pack. As you can see, every pack has five cards one secret rare and four ultra rares. There's some good stuff in this set. As you saw, Boral Sword Dragon, fantastic generic link monster. Um, there is a bunch of the Sky Striker cards if you like that deck. Sky Striker Mobilize Engage, the big one is in this. Widow Anchor, Afterburners, I believe, and a Secret Rare Ray, which is nice. And there's a bunch of reprints of cards that just get either rarity bumps or just reprints in general that have been needed. So, let's crack into our first pack. Yeah. Go away. And we're gonna start with the uh, Vision Fusion. Okay, so this is for Vision Heroes. They got a bunch of support in this set, too. Uh, I'm not gonna read every card, I'm gonna just kinda highlight uh, the Secret Rares. So, Vision Fusion Fusion, one hero fusion monster from your. I'm not gonna actually read this. So, we got Vision Fusion, TG Metal Skeleton, Vision Hero Trinity, Vision Hero Minimum Ray, and a TG Drillfish. So, there's a bunch of TG stuff in here, too. I'm also, I love the Battle Wasps. I, I am excited to have that deck as well. That's what I'm looking for out of this, because I want, I need, I just really need the Seeker Rare one now. Ooh, Seeker Rare Cyberstein. So, this card is, uh, <coughs> oh, I shouldn't say that. This card is a monster. It is, I'm surprised they unbanned it and it was a problem for a while, but I've actually never had a Cyberstein, so to have a Secret Rare one, that's pretty sweet, honestly. Luna Light Crimson Fox, great card that should have had a higher rarity initially, but now it has a Ultra, which is sweet. Collider Chicks in here too. Will the Salomon Great, for those Salomon Great players, you got reprints of this too in a higher rarity. Uh, we got Miracle Stone, and we got Guardian of Order. Apparently this card just hasn't, ha this is an old card and it like, never really had any play. But it hasn't had a reprint, so is that gotta really I gotta remember that there's like 24 picks, I think. TG TG Gears Dombie. This guy looks cool. TGs are cool, I've never really gotten into them. Battle Wasp Azu Azusa, I believe is how you pronounce it, the Ghost Bow. So I already had two of these, but another one is fine. Another Battle Wasp. Any Battle Wasps I want, which is fine. Fortune Rarity Chi, so the Fortune Fairies now have cards too, too in this set as well. Miracle Stone. Oh man, this is a mess, this is my first time kind of doing something like this. Mind you, I've done like the Bakugan openings before, but like, not a full booster box. Ooh, Elemental Hero Neos Knight! I knew this was reprinted, I didn't know it got a secret though! I wanted this card! Oh my god, this is a classic one if you remember from Bonds Beyond Time. I used to have, I used to have the original printing, but I, over time I just, it went missing, so... I'm glad, I didn't know it got secret though! That's sweet! Lucky Loan. Unacceptable result. Summon Limit, great card to get. And, wait, is, I thought the monster was, like, facing the other way. I'll have to check that. And Fortune Lady Sweet. Next pack. Let's get that Secret Rare Battle Wasp. Let's get Mobilize Engage. Let's get Lambda. Artifact Lancia! That's also really good. This is a great hand trap to counter car decks that banish, like Thunder Dragon. I do not like that deck. Uh, Sky Striker Maneuver Afterburners. So there's a Sky Striker card for us right there. Battle Wasp, Dart the Hunter, that's another one. Halberd the Charge, and Vision Release. 
Yeah, literally, I'm so happy my friend pulled the Boral Sword, because that was, like, the main card I needed from this. Uh, okay, so this is, like, a card that was from Duel Monsters, I think. Uh, Imperia, I don't, and I gotta be honest, I don't entirely remember, but it has a neat effect when it's summoned, you just, when it's summoned Imperia, you just draw a card, and you can only use it once per turn. I wonder if this might have use in the future, but you never know. Luna Light Crimson Fox, White Dragon, Wyvern Buster, I would like this card if it didn't make me think of Thunder Dragon and I'm upset. Uh, this card apparently is, a lot of people are talking this card may, could potentially enable FTKs or something, um, I think that's what it was, yeah, because it has a phase where it's, like, skip the battle phase of your next turn, also double the attack on one monster you control at the end of this turn, I mean, that might be the effect I'm thinking of, but, like, he looks cool, though, I'll give it that, Battle Wasp, Sting the, po that's Sting the Poison. You gotta understand, my, my favorite deck, my first, like, competitive deck was in Zectors, oh, double-headed anger knuckle so this is for trains an archetype i've always wanted to get i just never wanted to pay for and almost your absolute zero i actually only have a common print of this right now so i'm that's sweet to get the ultra gingerbread house this is another anime card that was made into a card here fortune fairy n and guardian of order Ooh, what do we got next what do we got next oh 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 that's a card Sky Striker Mobilize Engage. This is the big Sky Striker card. So if you don't know, if you control no monsters in your main monster zone, add one Sky Striker card from your deck to the hand, except Sky Striker Mobilize Engage. Then if you have three more spell cards in your graveyard, you can draw one card. It's kind of sort of like a pot of greed, except not really, but it's dumb. And this deck is stinky, but oh, Shadal's got stuff too in this, right? Oh, how about get Beast? I actually kind of need that for some deck, so. Shadal Hedgehog. Herald of Arclight. I actually don't think I had that, so that's cool to get. I love this one. This one's my favorite. Pin the bullseye. I don't care. He's just adorable. And then another Halberd of the Charge. All right, we got an engage. That's good. That's good. Again, again, like I said, everything here is bonus. Uh, Necroz Cycle. I don't... I gotta be totally honest with you guys. I don't know a lot about Necroz. I wasn't playing when Necroz were big. So that's that. Predoplast. I don't really know why that got a reprint. Uh, Fortune Fairy on. Salmon Great Sanctuary. Cool, cool. And Shadal Falco. People want those Salmon Great cards, like, the Salmon Great is one of the biggest decks ever right now. And it's very easy to play against, I don't think it's, it's doable, but it's like, oh look, Ray! This card actually looks stupid good in Secret. I don't really like Sky Striker, I might look into it just cause like, uh, I know some decks I can use it as an engine, but like, uh, this card looks really good as a Secret though, I will fully admit that. Vision Hero Witch Raider. Azusa the Ghost Bow. Elemental Hero Stratos, there he is, the freed man himself. <laughs> and Vision Hero Poisoner. Master Hero Acid reprint would have been nice in this, but it is what it is. Uh, Stars Mirage. Wow, I didn't know this was a card. You control a level later, hire a dragon type monster special summon as many monsters as possible from your graveyard that were destroyed and sent to the graveyard by battle or put this card back this turn. It's okay. Chanel Beast, cool. I need one of these. So we got one. Oh, so this is the big one. Battle Boss Ballista the Armageddon. Summoning Swarm. And Aeroblast the Rapid Fire. I can't wait to build Battle Boss, man. I know they're not a good deck, but like I, I love bees. I love insects. Ugh. Vision Hero Increase. We got, uh, I love him. I don't think he's that good, but he is number 26, Spaceway Octo Bypass. As you know, I love octopuses. Uh, Vision Hero Gravito. Shadal Squamata. And Battle Wasp Nest. I'm just putting all the Battle Wasp aside because I'm going to need them for later. Maybe a deck profile? We'll see. Once I learn the deck a little more. Boom. Oh, right. High Speed Roy's got a link. Oh, it's two Wind Monsters. You can use this for other stuff, too. That's cool. I forgot that. What's in this? Twin Bow. Uh, Battle Wasp. Uh, Twin Bow, the attacker. Battle Wasp, Dark the Hunter. Uh, Sonic Stun? I don't really... Oh, I don't know. Oh, it's a TG card. Okay. And Kaleido Check. That's cool. All right, uh, we're through the first half of the box, so we're gonna move on to the second half now. Yeah, what do we got here? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Oh yes, I wanted this because I hate this. I, I love this crappy archetype, Avengered Savior. I'm happy we finally got this card. I mean, Avengers are pretty booty, but like I like Avengers a lot because they're super cool, and I fell for the meme. But it is what it is. TG Metal Skeleton, Fortune Fairy Hue. Golden Moon Coin. This card, I just don't think... This is another anime card. I just don't think this card's that good. And Vision Release. Let's go on to another pack. Yeah. Harby Conductor. Okay, they got a Link 2 in here. I didn't know that. Artifact Scythe! Yeah, Artifacts! Right, we pulled Lancia already. 
<laughs> Artifact Scythe, I actually don't have one, so that's cool. Water of Life. Battle Wolf, Sting the Poison, and Fortune Fairy Chi. Next one. Just going through these, going through, breezing through these guys. I kind of want all eyes, but like, it's not that good. Oh, this guy's cool. I don't know if he's like super great or anything. I like his art though. Number seven, Dragul... Dragulbion? Dragulbion. I'll say it's that. That. Revival Swarm. Battle Wasp. Fortune Fairy and TG Drillfish. And Sub... Oh, right! Subterra Guru got a rarity bump in this. Deserved. This card really deserved a rarity bump. Because Subterras are cool. The problem is I can't play them because I don't have extravagance. And that card is expensive. Battles of Legend. Another time. Oh, so this is the Ultart Five-Headed Dragon. That's cool. Um, I know my friend really wanted this. So I'm going to give this to him, probably. Vision Hero Trinity. White Dragon Wyver Buster. Gaming Puppet Chimera, uh, Chimera Doll. Uh, I've never been big into uh, Gaming Puppets. I think the arts this card is really cool, though. And a Black Dragon Kaleida Serpent. Next one. Eh. Boom. Another Vision Fusion. Okay. Unacceptable result. Cryoplast, Destiny Hero Dangerous, and Fortune Fairy Sweet. How many got left? We got six left. Ugh. High Speed Roid Kite Drake. This is a cool card, actually. I, I don't. I, I think High Speed Roids are really cool. I just wish they were obviously a little better. But when one Wind Machine Tuner, if he was generic, this might be a little better, but. I think he looks cool, and I think he's super pretty to look at. Shadow Hedgehog, Vision Hero Witch Raider, Vision Hero Minimum Ray, and the symbol of friendship. I forgot this was in here. As you can see, I forgot a lot of things are in here. Uh, pack number five. We have what? Fifth to last pack. Oh! Ooh, Secret Rare Pankertops. This is a great reprint and a great rarity bump. So we got Secret Rare Pankertops. Oh, Magical Musketeer Max. I forgot this was in here. Foolish Burial. I wanted that. I wanted an Ultra Rare Foolish Burial. I know it's like... Not a big deal, because this has had many prints already, but, like, I actually don't have a high rarity Foolish Burial. I only have commons. Fortune Fairy N. And Lunalite Kaleido Chick. Pack number four. Well, fourth to last pack. We got, oh, another Lance. Yeah, yes, please. I ordered a playset of commons, but I'm okay with getting secrets. Lucky Alone. Vision Hero multi multi Multiply Guy. That's a good name. That's a good name. Salmon Great Sanctuary. Another one of those. Envision here, Poisoner. Okay, we're at our third to last pack. We got... Starlight Mirage. Stardust Mirage. Number 76, Harmonizer Grand Grandiel. Herald of Arclight. Battle Wasp, Air Lust, the Rapid Fire. And Black Dragon, Cloud Server. Second to last pack, guys. Another Avenger at Savior. That's pretty sweet. Battle Loss, Ozzy the Ghost Bow, uh, Twin Bow the Attacker, Sonic Stun, and a Gimmick Puppet Link. And our final pack, guys. So, can we pull? We haven't got him yet, which I still need this damn card, and it's like, it should not be that rare. Uh, so, can we pull that, though? Let's find out, because I kind of need one. At least one. Vision Hero Ferris. Okay, so, I know my friend was looking for this, so that's good. So, Vision Hero Ferris, Lucky Loan, Unacceptable Result. And Shadal, Squibata, and Summoning Swarm. So, that's going to conclude it for this opening, guys. So, again, we got some pretty good stuff. We got some pretty good stuff. I'm not saying we didn't. Vision of Paris, Adventure Savior, two Lancias. That's actually not supposed to be there. Pankertops. We got... Uh, where is... We got a Ray. We got a Mobilize Engage. It's the big one. We got... Oh, there's other Lancia, Cyberstein. So, I'm happy with this first box. Again, the fact that I have a Boral Sword guaranteed, I everything is bonus. So... Hope you guys enjoyed this video. My name is Lucas Pow. Uh, subscribe for more content. I'm going to try and get more Yu-Gi-Oh! stuff out as much as I can. Until then, guys, keep popping, alright?